I'm Davi Go, and today we are taking Quen Blackwell from this to this. It should be obvious by now, but this isn't an actual makeover. I'm just an illustrator doing fan art based on Quen. Before we go any further, I want to make it clear that this is not a tutorial. I'm just kind of skimming through this sped up recording of me coloring in this line work. I would have shown you everything I did from scratch, but I forgot to record from the beginning. Regardless, I'll try to make this as informative as I can. Quen Blackwell is an American comedian slash influencer. She makes a lot of funny videos that often go viral on sites like Twitter, Instagram, and TikTok. I've followed her for quite a while now and I really enjoy her, what I would call, crackhead brand of comedy. She's very zany and random and likes to show off her flexibility by contorting her body in awkward and sometimes grotesque ways. Though I can't guarantee this is going to look exactly like her, I'm taking inspiration from a particular look of Quinn's. Sometimes she wears this long, sleek, lilac or lavender colored wig that I think just looks so cool. It really reminds me of this fun, but super fucking awful, movie from 2006 called Ultraviolet. Starring longtime bad girl Mila Jovovich as a super assassin, Violet Song Jat Sharif, Ultraviolet tells a story I can't fully remember, but it had some really striking visuals. They were serving up some slick action, cool cyber pop costumes set against a bright, colorful, futuristic, and video game like metropolis. Unfortunately, a lot of the CGI quality was also like a video game from 1990. And the story just didn't add up. But I really didn't care too much back then. Seeing Mila Jovovich change her hair and outfit colors on command using some obscure sci-fi tech as she lay waste to countless shiny soldiers blew my mind as a kid. And that's where the spark started for this drawing. Like Violet, Quinn sometimes has lilac hair. And like Violet, Quinn has shown some extraordinary physical abilities. So, Quintra Violet, or a Ultra Quinn? Whatever. Point is, it's so cool to see such a talented, funny, and beautiful young woman exploring a style which is so nostalgic for me. The outfit I've designed here is just an exaggeration of some things I've seen Quen wear before. I really enjoy her like casual street style and I wanted to combine that with the bold red that I remember from Ultraviolet. So I just decided to turn up her style just a bit to make it a bit more sci-fi. My actual process here is a mix and match of mimicking traditional painting with the added benefit of layering and some kind of post-processing techniques. Layers are so important for me when working digitally. 
when organized properly, they can give me freedom to alter individual elements of a piece without affecting the whole thing. Alright, I think that is everything I have to say for right now. Like I said, this isn't a tutorial, so I guess you can just go ahead and enjoy the visuals for the rest of the video. But be sure to stick around until the end. I do have a bit of a special surprise um, that you didn't get to see at the start for the final, final image.
because I'm such an excellent YouTuber, I also neglected to record some finalizing parts of this process. But I basically just created and combined a few different filter effects to make the overall colors and mood more cohesive. And that's just about it. As a bonus, here she is in a mock poster for the Ultraviolet movie. Thanks for watching.